Aí, foto deste a dona. E a craca de pita em panela. So, uh, cute little one, except it is uh, dirty. And I did uh, try already to undo those buttons. The problem is not the rested screw, it is that even with undoing the screw, it will not come off at all. So I am not able to remove the buttons and I am not able to undo the front panel that could allow me to clean a little bit. Let me try another time, but if I remember correctly, this one comes off, but now I am uh, messing with uh, an annoying ring like this. But if I remember correctly, <coughs> oh, okay. Except this did come loose and will require some super glue, I believe. So, a little bit luckier this time. In fact, the key is to press the screw after you untighten it. Okay. So, it is good. I will be able to clean it after the video uh, the annoying parts are those ones however let me try to find out a suitable tool it is always a problem where you need to undo those kind of uh, crowns because it would require in fact having a very specific tube tool with a two teeth at the end of the exact correct size and it is always a problem to find something matching and if you try the wrong tool you will eventually damage do damage like this one is not working at all this one maybe you get the idea it is really annoying this kind of stuff mm. wow it is super tight it is a problem really really not that easy If you are trying with players like this, the players will just move and not remain at the correct spot. <coughs> ah. One is good. I will definitely not tighten them that much when assembling. at the end of travel, yes. Mm. Wow. The problem here is I believe I am turning the something inside which must not be turned because of how tight this is. Just try one more time with this one. Mm. Wow. Should come, should come, hopefully. Okay. Wow. We are good. So the cleaning work will be possible because as you can see it is quite filthy. So what do we have here? Uh, some kind of UHF 
control head uh, displaying your uh, radio frequency and uh, allow you, bring you to select your mode uh, and uh, test function volume here where the little knob here to really. another one thing so made by made by uh, Playsay Avionics on communications guarantee expires never it is good NATO stock number and it is called the manual UHF ok say number 462 a little bit of a trimmer here you can reach so I did already undo most of the screws because we had a number of them And we should be able to check the insides. So this will require further cleaning. So what do we have in here? guess is as good as mine okay at least nothing seems damaged by uh, me forcing the train to turn the buttons we have a stack of three circuit bars in the middle and I am having a look the two bottom bars are exactly uh, the same kind of this so it will not be necessary to undo them a very nice British pink wire here with super nice wirelessing. We have two rotary switches, gongs. Wow, we see the number of contacts down to back here, the latching part here for spring release effect. Here also, these ones are a little bit shorter, and I can see. I'm uh, not sure if it, how it will show on camera, but I can see very, very nice, wonderful even gold contacts. Look at these, they are coming through here to the legs here, and in here they are mega shiny. Huh. Sometimes I know in high grade equipment such contacts are massive gold. You have to scrape them a little bit and see if uh, there is another color of metal under uh, Actually I do, did do it on this one and it is a silver at the bottom So probably silver with a gold coating but still nice We have here <coughs> This okay for the front uh, Minitron displays, I believe they are. We will check out anyways. And it is all. You can see the construction L shape uh, box here. The front panel screwed on it, probably. Okay. Pretty uh, simple and straightforward. So let me try to undo this uh, front uh, cover. And find out how dirty it is behind. Mm. Okay. Mm. Nice so far. Mm. For sure, it was not removed since a long, long time. Simpler than expected, you can see how dirty this uh, filter is here. Ah, we have that code apparently 88, cyan number 37 for this uh, part, but maybe 
it is a retrofit, it was replaced at some point, maybe it is not uh, as old as the one unit. So about the displays, yes, there are mini trons, and you can see this one is very, very worn out. You can see a glare. Uh, the metal did uh, vaporize and deposit it on the front glass. This one also, so these are uh, very uh, consumable items with displays. I might have replacements. Okay, so uh, very nice uh, little unit. There is a circuit board here at the bottom for I can see resistors on it for all the connections and whatnot. Little uh, stickers on the wire looms also with the numbers. Okay. A beautiful little unit. After cleaning, it should look nice. I will try to do my best because this is a uh, a nice little keeper. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.